It's Friday, November 16th, 2012. I'm David Pierce, that's the Wii U, and this is 90 Seconds on the Verge. Apple's new iPads are now available with LTE. AT&T, Sprint, and Verizon have all confirmed they'll be carrying both the iPad mini and the fourth generation Retina iPad. You can also buy from Apple directly, though it's still quoting a two week shipping delay. The iPad mini with LTE starts at $459. That's $130 more than the Wi-Fi only version. Take it from me though, it's worth it. And now for another chapter in space. Space! Scientists have discovered what might be the farthest known galaxy in the universe. Galaxy MACS0, you, you know what, let's call it Susan. Galaxy Susan is estimated to be about 13.3 billion light years away. Since our universe is said to be just 13.7 billion years old, that faint red light may offer a glimpse of life, the universe, and everything back when we were just a baby 420 million years old. Finally, Sony is celebrating 70 million PlayStation 3 consoles sold. That more or less exactly matches the figure set by the Xbox 360, which Microsoft said passed the 70 million mark last quarter. It's quite an achievement for Sony, especially since the PS3 had a less than seller launch. Sony's milestone comes just two days before Nintendo's new Wii U console hits the market. And of course, Sony and Microsoft are rumored to have consoles coming next year. So things might change quickly. And that's it for today's top stories. Tune in tomorrow, but to be honest, we won't be here. I'll be here. Roswell. <laughs>